Well, as the novel coronavirus continues to batter the world, Pakistani government, in its latest report to the country's EPICS court, has suggested that there might be over 50,000 confirmed cases of COVID-19 by April 25th. In its report on National Action Plan against COVID-19, the government detailed the situation arising in the wake of the pandemic and the severity of the suspected cases. The report suggests that there might be close to 41,000 mild infections with 7,000 critical and 2,500 to be extremely critical cases. The Pakistani government has vowed that it would increase the testing capability daily at an additional cost of $366 million. Pakistan is failing in its fight against COVID-19 reports of a lack of adequate screening procedures and squalid living conditions at the quarantine camps at the Taftan border crossing have raised concerns about the surge in the number of infections further. The increase in the number of cases shows that there was a uh, little impact of the measures, including partial lockdown, taken so far to reduce the spread of the virus.